Alright guys, welcome to a new video. In this video we're going to be playing The Binding of Isaac Rebirth and I'll be showing you guys how to use Cheat Engine to unlock any item in the game. First thing what you're going to want to do is go to the first link in the description, download the Cheat Engine software. Once you've got that installed, you want to go to the second link in the description which will be a save file for the Cheat Engine called Isaac-NG. You want to download that and put it on your desktop and then you're going to want to go ahead and open that with Cheat Engine itself. Once you've got that open in Cheat Engine, you want to make sure you have the Binding of Isaac itself open, and then within Cheat Engine, you want to select the computer, which should be highlighted, which will open a process list. Within the process list, you're going to want to find the Binding of Isaac, select it, and press open. Say yes to keep the current address and code list. And now what you want to do is actually go on the Binding of Isaac itself and start a run. So I'm going to start a new save here. And what the object we're going to be doing here is, is to find an item room. So I'm going to refresh my run until I find an item room near the spawn. So what we'll be doing here is probably quite complicated compared to the rest of the tutorial. You're going to want to go inside an item room. And you can see the item here on the pedestal. Now you're going to want to go on Cheat Engine and find the pedestal script within the save file. And select the active box next to it. This is going to replace any item that's in the room currently with whatever selected as the value on pedestal item ID, it's defaulted to blue map secrets. If I leave the room and come back in, pick the item up and do the same again, the blue map has spawned. So if I pick this item up, I can now go in Cheat Engine and change the value from blue map to any item I want. If you double, uh, double click the value box, it'll open up a drop down list which has every item in the game as far as I know. So you can simply find one that you like and select it. So for example here, if I wanted the Holy Mantle, just select it and press OK. Go on the game, make sure you pick up whatever's on the pedestal, leave the room, and then re-enter, and then whatever item you selected should spawn. So there's the Holy Mantle. If I pick this up, the value within G Engine will automatically go back to the default, which is blue map. So you'll need to change this value every time you pick the item up. If you want multiple of one item, you can just continually walk into the pedestal. And I keep picking it up, see that blue map, blue map, over and over again. But if you wanted to change it again, all you need to do is select the item you want, leave the room and re-enter, and it should spawn on the pedestal. You can do this as many times as you want, it stacks infinitely, and you can do it with any item that's within the drop-down list. So essentially, you can get anything you want. You want Godhead, you got that. You want the Super Meat Boy achievement, you pick up four cubes of meat, you're done. So uh, there's lots of things you can accomplish with this, or you can just make yourself overpowered as hell. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial, and uh, I'll be sure to see you guys next time.